storytelling is like a machine that makes empathy. It makes happiness and sadness, and it is a way to transmit emotions and information across borders and across countries and across oceans. I mean, you feel like you can write anything when you see the waves crashing in, and, and other times I've written in sort of scary pockets of the world, and I think you can feel that energy in those stories, too. The most important thing is to find a place that makes you confident that you can do your best work, that this is the place where I am going to be good. get together to celebrate the many ways in which uh, stories can move us, connect us, and hopefully, ideally, drive some kind of change. I use my notebook as a passport to cross borders. I use it as a reason to sit not in judgment, but to bear witness to other people's realities. We are all version of the past. Our past, and that of the others, the past of our countries and the past of our languages. You have to think, what did you dream to become when you are young? Because life drives you in different directions. <laughs> For me, drawing is a way of looking. It's an opportunity to look at things that we might be uncomfortable with or afraid of. If we can turn the camera from ourselves out into the world instead, I think we would make a better world. Good writing comes from working, sometimes thoughtlessly. It comes from remembering and forgetting at the same time. But I say yes because I am curious. And it's such an enormous celebration of curiosity that sometimes you just want to lie down and say thank you to the entire universe that this is the way you're allowed to lead your life. Yeah.